Hey man, look, this is how I'm gonna tell you why I think LeBron probably gonna go to Philly, man. First, I wasn't sure. Uh, you know what I mean? I seen, I was like, LA, maybe Philly. But you know, LeBron good with like controlling the media, so he do little stuff so that the media keep talking about him. You know what I mean? They talked about him every day this week. It's him and the Cavaliers. But look, that's why I think LeBron going to Philly, man. Like, lately though. He just played. He just played against Philly. And he was like all smiles. Him and Ben Simmons, you know what I mean? Joel B. Mind you, Philly got uh the Sixers got billboards in Cleveland talking about you know complete the process. Real bold. They put billboards in Cleveland talking about complete the process to tell LeBron to come there next year because you know after this year he'd be eligible to you know sign somewhere else. But. He was smiling. He's smiling. Mind you, this is a, this. He got a new team he's dealing with that he got, he just put together for itself. You know what I mean? And he's and and at the end, uh, Sar Sarge kind of like took a dunk at the end after the clock was kind of like you know what I mean it was like twelve seconds left or something and he was already up and Jordan Clarkson hitting with the ball. So you know LeBron got the arguing too, diffusing it but arguing too with with Sarge and you know the Sixers. But then right after that he dapping them up. Mind you, Clarkson got ejected. You know, the energy from there is like, man, after them dudes, man, we ain't fuck them. You know what I mean? Fuck them. But nah, LeBron smiles, daps, and pounds, you know. I'm, I might be coming over here next year. What's up, y'all? Oh, uh, man, I don't know what's up with Clarkson. That type of energy, like. So, yeah, he might be going to Philly, man. Straight up. And you got to think, though, that's a young, it's two young guys right there that are going to be, like, all-stars and top Athletes in his league, you know what I mean, for a while. LeBron's, uh, he's on a, the, he's on the bottom half of his career. You know what I mean. He's still, he's still doing amazing things this year, but he's on the bottom half of his career. And pickles, I know. pickles, yeah. And catch up. Yeah, he's on the bottom half of his career, on the downside of his, you know what I mean, of his career. So he gonna be able to feed off them for for a couple more years. I mean, you know, right pieces around there and with um, uh Ben Simmons and LeBron. Man, they, can, man they, can, they can get some chips, bro. And he's still in the East where he don't really got to compete with a whole bunch of different, you know what I mean? It's easy. Like, the East, it's still easy. He's not going over the fly, going to go over the West like that, you know. He's, he got to face all them teams before he get to the finals. He ain't trying to miss too many finals, you know. He ain't got, he ain't got too many more times to miss finals in him. So, he get to still benefit by playing in the East and playing with them dudes. Man, I think he might go over there, man. Straight up, unless Cleveland can do some miraculous stuff for him, I mean, which they already doing everything he asked. But that's something. It gotta be something drastic happen like it this year. They are not gonna beat no team in the West in the finals this year. Not with the team they got right now. I don't see it happening. So I don't know. You know, that's just how I see. It, man, he I might mean, he might be going to Philly next year, man. Well. Uh -uh.